Police in New York City restoring calm tonight after a riot broke out in Manhattan's Union Square neighborhood. A crowd estimated at 2,000 people descended into the area after popular social media influencer Kai Sanat advertised a video game giveaway. The crowd appearing to be mostly young people turned restless and then unruly, surging into the streets, some throwing objects, others climbing onto vehicles, as well as the roof of a major subway hub. All of it paralyzing traffic at the height of the evening rush. Police quickly moved in in mass, working to regain control block by block. Tonight, mayhem in Manhattan, with police say at least 2,000 people mobbing Union Square, getting on top of cabs and the entrance to a subway, jumping on food carts, pushing, shoving, and throwing objects as police eventually move in. It's a lot of people. I went over there and it's like, yikes, it's like a lot of crowd. Like, but like, I don't even know how to explain it. It's like, were you, were you scared? I'm not gonna lie, yeah, I was, kind of, I was kind of panicking. The NYPD says it began after a social media influencer known as Kai Sanat planned an event to give away PlayStations at 4 o'clock this afternoon. We just decided to come not knowing what we were going to expect or whatever. By 3.30, hundreds of people had already gathered. The crowd was swarmed when the influencer finally arrived at the park. Individuals in the park began to commit acts of violence towards the police and the public. Everybody was throwing everything, climbing thing. The NYPD declaring a level four mobilization. What appear to be hundreds of police officers quickly on the scene. At one point, pulling someone out of the crowd. What did you see? We were there, we were chilling. People started throwing stuff like glass, cans, everything. And then as we're walking away, we hear a big dud. And we just heard another loud bang. It seems like a firework went off. After numerous warnings and after being assailed, hit with rocks and bottles and other debris, we started to make arrests. And that the social media influencer is in custody.